Oh no, oh no, oh no. Messi Chinwo again. Hmm. See, those of you carrying it in your head that uh, Messi Chinwo is going to do DNA test. This woman don't have you people time. It's better for you guys to just go and rest. You understand? It's better for you guys to just go and rest. They will only decide if they um this thing are ready to do that because i'm going to review what she actually posted she actually made some post on facebook that shows that she's not even 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 concerned about those people complaining that the baby looked like nathan ebasi it looked like this although it is true that the baby looked like nathan ebasi and many people ask on um, this thing call for dna test but it's a choice now to do the dna test or not and strongly if she believes the baby is her own strongly she doesn't even need to prove anything because not every um stuff you have to prove out there you understand but you know if majority of your fans are demanding for dna test and majority are not demanding you know you have to do the dna test but after screen on comments you know i don't know maybe she's hiding those comments or i don't know what's with but after screen on comments on the two posts she made i had I, I did not even see even to people requesting for DNA test. So that means she's she's likely not to do it again. So if you are one of the people that you know you are planning for her to do DNA test, tackling her here and there saying uh Messi Chimo must do DNA test, my friend, it's better for you to just go and sit your eyes down and you know focus on other thing because this issue will only proceed if those people that she summoned, you know, to come to court also come and they drop their own because I believe by now, though if those people are, are, are coming you know they will have meet together you know they will have chat themselves up meet together and they'll still write what you know practice what they'll use against her so if what they use against her actually has meaning the court might you know might be like okay my situation was um suing them that they third are um this thing something that seems to be right and now you have to carry out the dna test and if she can eventually carry out the dna test and the baby belongs to her you see that those people who are saying that Messi Chinwo's child is Nathan Ebasi are in serious soup because they are going and I believe they are going to be jailed in this. So actually, these are the posts she made, you know, on Facebook. You can see the post on the screen. I've posted it on the screen. She made this post, and after reading the post, you see that she's not even concerned. She doesn't even want that um issue to affect as um spreading of the gospel. You understand? She's still focused, and that's very, very good for her. So if she have any, maybe when she have um free chance or something like that because you know you can't compare the the the, the way she's choked up compared to those people um tackling her that her baby is not you know um Nathan Ebasi's uh, it's not um uh, pastor bless own which is her husband that is for Nathan Ebasi and she doesn't have much time you know to carry out those um strength you know to tackle all those things at once but I believe gradually she will be doing it you understand so uh we're also still waiting for more you know, we're also still waiting for more talk from her. You know, she should say another thing much more related to that. But as of now, I'm clear in the air that Mr. Chingo is not ready. She's not even showing any sign that that they are, as they are even tackling her that her baby is, you know, that an adversity baby. She's not even showing any sign that it's if she's affected or even concerned about that until maybe those five people she um this thing she actually sue to court we actually come and those people if they didn't come that means they don't they don't know what they are saying because they just came out to cap if truly they know what they are saying and have strong evidence and everything which i believe they don't have because you are not there when she's giving birth to the baby you understand so you can't come with for your full chest and say that baby looks like nathan Ebasi. although for your first child to resemble another person is a kind of strange it do happen yes it's not I'm not saying it cannot happen because most of you who come now, you will not even understand what I'm saying. You come in the comment section and start, you know, telling me I said, I said most time the first child usually resembles the, 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 the mother the, or the father, the parents, yes. But in some rare occasion, it might not resemble any of them. If you have observed it, you can observe around you. When you look at the first child, when people gave back to their first child, it's 90% going to resemble them. But sometimes it doesn't resemble them. Maybe the rest that we come might, you know, resemble one of them. But mostly that first child is either to resemble the mother or to resemble the father. You understand? It's always happened that they resemble. But, you know, Messi Chinwo's um, child now went to resemble another person. And that's, that's kind of, you know... It's um it's kind of strange, you understand? It's kind of strange, but I never said that that means the baby is for Nathan Ebasi. No, my is the DNA is only what I can prove now. 
any other thing is just beating around you know the bush but for now what i can prove that that baby actually belongs to a dna test and that's if she decides to do it if she doesn't decide to do it it's none of anybody's concern if the baby is not an ambassador it's not of anybody's concern that's only if you decide to do the dna test so i want to hear your own opinion in the comment section and share my own opinion with you guys let me hear from you in the comment section see you in my next video